very essence of any business is to cater needs of customers by providing services and goods, and in the process create value for customers and solve their problems. Production and Operations Management talks about applying business organization and management concepts in the creation of goods and services. Let's start by talking about production. Production is a scientific process which involves transformation of raw material or input into desired product or service or output by adding economic value. Production can broadly categorize into the following types based on technique. Number 1, production through separation. It involves desired output is achieved through separation or extraction from raw materials. A classic example of separation or extraction is oil into various fuel products. Number 2, production by modification or improvement. It involves change in chemical and mechanical parameters of the raw material without altering physical attributes of the raw material. The annealing process, which means heating at high temperatures and then cooling, is example of production by modification or improvement. And, number 3, production by assembly, car production and computer are examples of production by assembly. So, what is the importance of production function and production management? Successful organizations have well-defined and efficient line functions and support functions. Production comes under the category of line function which directly affects customer experience and thereby the future of the organization itself. The aim of the production function is to add value to the product or service which will create a strong and long-lasting customer relationship or association. And this can be achieved by the healthy and productive association between marketing and production people. Marketing function people are frontline representatives of the company and provide insights to the real product needs of customers. An effective planning and control on production parameters to achieve or create value for customers is called production management. Now, when we discuss about operations management. As to deliver value for customers in products and services, it is essential for the company to do the following. Number 1, identify the customer needs and convert that into a specific product or service, which includes the numbers of products required for a specific period of time. Number 2, based on product requirement do backward working to identify raw material requirements. And, number 3, engage internal and external vendors to create the supply chain for raw material and finished goods between the vendor, the production facility, and the customers. Operations management captures these three identified points. A high-level comparison which distinct production and operations management can be done on the following characteristics. Number 1, based on output, production management deals with manufacturing of products like computer, car, etc., while operations management cover both products and services. Number 2, based on usage of output, products like computer or car are utilized over a period of time, whereas services need to be consumed immediately. Number 3, based on classification of work, to produce products like computer or car, more of capital equipment and less labor are required, while services require more labor and lesser capital equipment. And, number 4, based on customer contact, there is no participation of customer during production whereas for services a constant contact with customer is required. So, production management and operations management both are very essential in meeting the objectives of an organization.